Oh, so tell me your name. My name is Arlene. I go to a place called Wilmer's Chemist, and I said to them, I'm really looking for, I said, I hope this doesn't sound too weird, but a holistic dermatologist? And I said, somebody who does holistic work? And he's like, I just happen to have someone's card. I had um, what I was told was eczema. And I had been seeing another doctor who was uh, known as like the, one of the best in New Jersey. And I'd seen other doctors over the course of, from the time I was young for this. Um, and everyone I went to just kept giving me steroid creams and ointments and it would work at the time I put it on to stop the itching and it wouldn't really stop the breakouts. And um, I had this, I was at the point when I came to Dr. Datner that I literally couldn't put anything in my mouth to eat. I mean, I was eating, my friends own an organic store. I was eating uh, spinach salad with just spinach, carrots, and um, Italian canned tuna in olive oil. That's the only thing I could eat where I wouldn't scratch immediately afterwards. So when I came to him, my skin was really rough and hard and my face and most of the skin on my body was like uh, two shades darker than I am now. Um, and it was dry and very, very itchy and I had cracks and there were open sores. I had had eczema from what am I understanding ever since I've been at least six months old. At one point it kind of went dormant. It seemed like it went dormant. I always had itchy, itchy spots. I was very depressed. I was also pretty sick often because I kept getting infections from, from the open wounds, um, from the, 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 the cracks in my skin, I was getting infections. And I just felt hopeless because nothing seemed to work. And when I came to Dr. Datner, he helped me. Uh, he, he immediately understood. He said there was something with my gut. Um, and I wasn't digesting properly and the more I told him the more he was able to go into his computer brain and pull out information and I found that it was a it was a relationship a give you know I had to give I gave him information and he gave me back information and I took the information he gave me and I worked on it then I came back and said what the results were and this worked and that didn't work and I feel like this and I noticed this and I noticed that you know he helped me with supplements that would help with my um, down mood as well because he said it's a holistic approach and and you know I felt like that too and it was really great to hear to have a doctor that felt and thought the same way I did because everyone else I went to was just looking at my skin and treating my skin and I always look at my skin it's like this is much better than it once was and I said um, and this one lady said well isn't it eczema I said well it's eczema brought on by and that's the way I feel like it is now. I, I understand. I've gotten such an education from Dr. Dadner. Such an, uh, he empowered me by giving, telling me things. And he really treated me like I was part of, like he couldn't do this without me and I couldn't do it. Like I knew I couldn't do it without him. But he would say things to me and if I didn't go home and try it or do it or think about it, then it wouldn't work. But if I went home and tried it, then I'd come back and say, well, this worked and this worked. And guess what? I felt better. And that made me feel really good that I was, it wasn't just him being the doctor and me being the patient, which was usually what, what happened. Um, and I, you know, so that felt good. When I started seeing the first thing he did was like, he looked at my skin and he said, you know, you have rough patches and you have thickening of the skin. And, and he like, he was giving names to things that I didn't, like I thought and felt but didn't know and then I had like a lot of between the seams of my finger the joints um, like my skin would crack and I noticed if I ate a certain type of I want to say a certain type of sugar it was sugar in combination with something I'm not sure what that my skin would just litter right before my eyes crack and he said well there's this salve we could put on it you know to help it heal and it was funny because the supplements that he gave me didn't work immediately. They didn't work immediately. They're not supposed to, you know, you're, it's healing from the inside. Um, and I remember when he gave me something for the cracks and it literally closed up the same way it kind of opened up. And, and it was just like, oh, this is inside and outside work I have to do. I have to do both. Um, and he said to me, you know, this is something that took time to get this way. It's going to take time to heal. And I knew that, 
but hearing someone else say it that way, it wasn't like, take this pill, this is going to stop the itching, and take this and do this. And he also gave me something to help me with the itching. He was willing to work on all different levels. I went to try on some clothes, and I just happened, and this is recently, this was about two weeks ago, I just happened to really look in the mirror and realize that my skin tone was even again. In, in, in the areas that I was completely like two shades darker, my entire skin tone had come back to its natural color. Just I teared up when I saw it because I was like, I never thought that it was going to come back. You know, I thought I was going to be, you know, patchy looking, you know, and it was really good that so the before and after was before I felt like, there's no other word to describe it, I felt like a monster. I felt like a monster. I didn't want my husband to see me, you know, to touch me um, because of where my skin felt to me, as so I knew it would feel strange to him. And now, you know, I walk around with short sleeves, I walk around, I go to dressing rooms and I can look at myself when I change. And I don't mind when my husband rubs my hand or holds my hand because I don't feel like a monster. Mm.